This is code.org. Let's see what we're doing. Debug naming variables. This program has multiple errors caused by bad variable names. Labels. Oh no, which is a variable name, right? That's this thing and this thing. The errors prevent the program from being viewed in block mode. They do? Oh, sad day. Um, so the code is in text, okay? Below are a few rules for naming variables. Click help and tips above to read more. Yeah, tons of information here that you can use when you get mixed up on stuff. Super handy. All right. Labels can't have spaces. Yeah. So a variable's name, and when I say a variable's name, by the way, this is where we make a variable, and this is the name of it. We can never have a space there. It confuses computers, actually. So I'm just going to go die. Die. I know. I'm a murderer. I killed some spaces. Calm down. All right. So now it's yellow. We'll get to that in a second. That actually means something very specific. Also, guys, I want to point out, hi, I program, I code. I've done it for years and years and years. It's fun. This is what real programming is. What you're learning right now is JavaScript. In JavaScript, you can't have spaces and variables. You also can't have spaces and variables in Python, C Sharp, C++, Swift, uh, Swift, Assembly, basically any language I can think of. So be proud of yourself. This is real code. Labels can't start with a number. Nope, never. I don't know of any language that they can, honestly. So you need to do it like that. Now, if you really wanted, we could have a number here or maybe here, but you can never start a variable with a number. Capitalization and spelling must be exactly the same. This is important. So computers can only do what we tell them. And if I have a capital L here, and I don't know, maybe down here, I have a capital Y and L suddenly. Wait a minute. I don't have a capital Y here. This here with the lowercase y is as close to this. If this said red, that word and this word are pretty close to the computer. And same thing here. It doesn't see the same. A y and a letter and the number seven, if it's capitalized, it's that close. It has no idea what you mean. So you just got to be super careful. Now, lowercase, it sees it. It gets that they're the exact same. All right, now dimension, well, it no longer matches. Yellow means, hey, you have a variable, but you're not using it. Why is it here? Well, I'm not using it because I have the wrong name down. Whoops, my bad. I have the wrong name down here. Notice the yellow's gone because it's like, thank you. Thank you for using me. It said that. You just missed it. Boom. No spaces, no spaces. Make look good and happy. Oh, one more hidden over here. So there's two ways. Once I can run this, but also now I can go back to the block mode of happiness. Let's give it a shot. Super important stuff there. You really do need to know how variables work because we're going to do some awesome stuff with them. Onward.